This video demonstrates how to replace a walk-in swing door gasket. Plan 10 to 15 minutes to complete this project. To replace a walk-in swing door gasket, you need a wedge to hold the door open, a power drill with a Phillips head bit, a hammer and a small wood block, scissors to trim the gasket, fast setting glue with the pads to finish the bottom of the gasket, and a new gasket. The old gasket will be destroyed when it is removed. Begin by blocking the door open using your wedge. Then use your power drill and a Phillips bit to remove the two screws holding the gasket in place at the top of the door. With the screws removed, start working the gasket free from the door. Discard the gasket once it is removed. The old gasket is no longer usable. Start installing the new gasket by aligning the gasket and hanging it on the top of the door. Carefully align the top corners of the gasket and seat them using soft taps with your hammer. Using the wood block will help seat the larger lengths of the gasket. When the gasket is properly seated on top of the door, insert the two screws to hold it in place and begin to work down both sides of the door, seating the gasket as you move downward. With the gasket in place and fully seated, there is a small amount of trim required on the gasket ends. Use your scissors or even tin snips to trim the loose ends of the gasket. Then apply a small amount of quick setting glue to the gasket end pads and place them into each end of the gasket holding them in place an appropriate amount of time for the glue to take hold. This completes the gasket replacement process. 
Remove the wedge from the door and test the door and gasket for proper closing and sealing. You may need to adjust the latch and other hardware to accommodate the new gasket. Follow the appropriate videos on our website or YouTube page for those instructions. More technical videos are available from the Imperial Brown website or directly on the Imperial Brown YouTube channel. Leave us a comment on YouTube, Facebook, or Twitter and let us know how your replacement went or to suggest another video.